You must be making a killing with the state this city's in. Ain't that right, Ayabe? And it's all thanks to you. Do you know anything about the Matsugane shooting last night? Not too much, no. But hey, I thought you got Higashi for all your Matsugane needs now. Word travels fast. Who told you that? Kaito. Just now. Huh? You forget how to keep a secret, Kaito-san? Or are you trying to get your buddy killed? Higashi's screwed if Hamura finds out he's been helping us. Look, man. There's no point keeping stuff from Ayabe. Better to just tell him up front than have him find out somewhere else. What can I say? I'm a professional. Sure. Professional snitch. If the shoe fits. But sorry. I really don't have much for you today. Say what? You telling me I bought you a drink for nothing? What? Our time's too tough to buy around? Here. Let me at least repay you for the booze. Go on. <laughs> Did you know Hamura's in hiding? He's been out of the office ever since last night. Not even the cops can find the guy. <sighs> yeah, Higashi told us as much, actually. You charging us for this old news? I'm starting to wonder here. Okay, okay, fine. You want answers? Go ahead and ask. Everything's on the house for tonight. I'd rather talk business than sit here in silence anyway. Sounds good to me. Let me think. Why are the Kyori and Kamurocho to begin with? What's a Kansai group doing this far from home? Because they wanted turf in Tokyo, duh. Even if it meant war with the Tojo? They couldn't have the numbers for that. True. Compared to the Tojo's 25,000, Kyori have a meager thousand at most. Plus, Kamurocho is not exactly their home turf. And by that logic, they don't stand a chance. And yet they've been here almost two years now. Crazy when you think about it. Even the cops put money on the Tojo clan, crushing them into dust. So, what's the holdup then? The Kyore has the backing of the Kajihiro group. In other words, a lot of fucking money. Kajihiro? Isn't he a construction bigwig? Yep. And one of his subsidiaries is the perfect Kyore cover. I suppose you'd know it better as KJ Art. Yeah, we're familiar. What does Kajihira have to do with the Kyore? Why is he funding Yakuza? Probably so he can expand East out of Kansai. The real money is out here anyway. From what I hear, He's got some big redevelopment plans for Tokyo. What kind of plans are we talking? Not a clue. But if they're coming from Kansai to do it, shit's gotta be important. And there's always dirty work with those kind of jobs, you know? Like what? Evictions, land sharks, laying the political groundwork. The Kyore is handling all that shit for Kajihira. At least, that's the word on the street. Yeah, thanks. These rumors of yours are gonna do us a ton of good. Well, what I know for sure is that the Kajihira CEO's been up in Tokyo a lot lately. Schmoozing with politicians, government officials, even Kazumi, the head of the Ministry of Health. Why would a construction guy be talking to someone from the Health Ministry? What's the connection? Beats me. Point is... The Kyore aren't here just for Yakuza shit. It's way more complicated than that. How are things in the Matsugane family? Well, you already know about the shooting. Their hands are tied while the cops are running the show. So, yeah, they've been pretty quiet.
How's Kamurocho seem to you lately? Tense. And that shooting only made things worse. Nobody knows when the next fight'll break out, or where a stray bullet might end up. Right. And our killer's only gone for Yakuza so far, but he could target anyone next. Gunfights? A murderer on the loose? This city's a mess. <laughs> you got that right. By the way, Amura might have walked, but the cops are still pretty fixated on this mole case. Even the public's wondering who'll be next. Huh. Just wondering, how does it feel when people call you a dirty cop? Eh, anyone who knows that side of me ain't exactly a saint either, you know? Good point. That's the pot calling the kettle black, or the kettle calling the pot black, whatever. <laughs> yeah, guess so. All right, I gotta go. Already? You're a busy boy. Yeah. Kaito-san? Huh? Yagami and Kaito, yes. What an honor. Tokyo Police. The name's Kuroiwa. Kuroiwa. The one who almost put Hamura behind bars, before you two pulled him out of my grasp. Huh. <laughs> so what? <laughs> I've become a department punchline now. I have you to thank. Hmm, you're very welcome. And I see you're <laughs> here too, Ayabe. Oh, Kuroiwa-san. Nice nights. It's great to see you. Yeah. I cut out of work to grab a few drinks. You doing the same, Ayabe? Nah, <laughs> old me? I don't play hooky. Well, we should be on our way. Hey, let me ask before you go. The Okubo case. You let that murderer get off scot-free. After which he burned his poor girlfriend to death. And yet, here we are with another murderer roaming the streets of this city. I wonder who the next victim will be. You consider that, Yagami-sensei. Good talk? Yeah, I'm used to dealing with assholes like that. What was Kuroiwa doing there anyway? I bet he knows about Ayabe's little side gig. Probably came to keep him from chirping too much. Right. Or maybe he wanted to keep an eye on us. Hope not. I don't need that guy breathing down our necks. Anyway, you wanna head home? Not yet. Something's bugging me about the Kyore clan. What do you mean? Until today, I just thought they were here scouting out some new turf in Kamurocho. But it turns out they've got a construction conglomerate behind them, and they're involved in redevelopment, too. So you want to figure out who the real Kyore is? Not a bad idea. But how are we going to investigate? You don't remember? We have a friend on the inside. <laughs> you mean Morase? Oh, yeah. Come on, let's head to KJ Art. Hey, talk. We're getting close to KJR. Hey, you want to bust out the drone? See what our old friend Murase is up to? Yeah, should be pretty easy to find him this time. <laughs> right this way. Right, 
It's spy time. Okay, I'll handle the flying. You keep watch on anyone coming in or out. There he is. <laughs> right where I expected. Yeah, not so sure it's that simple, though. Take another look. Morase's alone. Your point being? Hands up. Matsugane guy died at our hands. Always knew we'd get some Tojo clan boys sent over here. So, you see, we've been expecting guests this whole time. Yagami-san. <laughs> ideas, Kaito-san? I, uh... You're the ideas guy, aren't you? Damn it. If you two clowns really were Tojo clan, We'd have gouged your eyes out by now. The hell is crap! Town's sure noisy, huh? No one will care about, say, a couple of gunshots up here. Whose bright idea was this? This guy. Huh, is that really how it's gonna be, Kaito-san? <laughs> and just who are you? Good question, Kaito-san. Satoshi Shioya's the name. The Kyori clan's captain, huh? Higashi mentioned him. Hey! Get some cuffs on these fools. I've got some burning hot questions to ask them. <laughs> you ready? I think we're gonna have a little fun. You think I'm messing around? Take him out now! No! Shoot him! Shit! You? Why? Is this really the time? Fair enough. <laughs> Come on. Let's move!
That's enough. Come on, let's roll. Yeah, no reason to stay here. We owe you one. You should come with us. Hmm. Coming? Sure. May as well. Wait, just like that? Hold up. I'm not letting you assholes get away that easily. Yakuza don't fuck around. <laughs> you three are gone. <laughs> well, shit. You're not half as ugly as I figured you were. <laughs> What can I say? Not a... good idea? Well... Not like I'll get very far with it on, you know? <laughs> okay. Let's go. Guys, what the hell were you thinking coming here? What? You don't want us around? No. It's just, if Captain Hamara saw you here, he... How's he gonna find us if he's off the grid? What are you worried about? Yeah, but... Forget it. Who's your friend? Good question. I'm Sugiura. Fumiya Sugiura. This isn't the first time Sugiura here has saved my neck. That mask. Ain't that the symbol of some big time burglary ring? It is, but I bailed on that. I'm flying solo now. 
And what were you doing over by KJR? Don't want to talk? No, I just don't know where to start. It's kind of complicated. Hmm? Okay, well, I used to work for the Kajihira group down at their headquarters in Kansai. You mean the guys backing the Kilray clan? Yeah. I had a job doing IT work for them for a bit. Keeping their servers safe, that kind of stuff. I was their systems engineer. Go on. Well, one day I noticed some accounting data was off. They were cooking the books. Really? Turns out the top guys were making a slush fund. They stashed away millions, writing it all off as some vague business expense. Digging it all up was kind of a thrill. <laughs> Until I got caught. Everything happened so fast after that. They accused me of embezzling company funds and threw me out on the street. Nobody would believe a word I said. But I knew where the money was going. A group of Yakuza known as the Kyorei clan. Specifically, a shell company called KJ Art. If I could just prove it, I'd be able to get back at the bastards who cheated me. Which is why you were staking out the place. I've been keeping watch over there for a while now. <laughs> I even saw you break in and beat the crap out of Murase. Assuming all that's true, why did you rescue us? You remember when you asked to team up? Yagami-san? I thought about it, and... It seems like a pretty good deal. Might be worth putting our heads together for a while. Me and the Yagami Detective Agency. <laughs> Especially you, Kaito-san. Huh? No matter how many Yakuza come to take you down, you always have it handled. It's incredible. <laughs> what can I say? You got a good eye, kid. And don't let it go to your head. Hey, can you guys please take this shit elsewhere? So, what do you say? I'm not saying we've got to become best buddies, but we can at least give each other a hand. How? You want your mole? I want the Kyorei clan. We might not be after the same thing, but there's a lot of overlap. How can I get in touch with you? Will that work? How the hell did you do that? I took your phone, remember? Not like I had to hack it or anything. Ah, kids these days. You know? I kind of like this Sugiura kid. That little compliment really won you over, huh? It's not like I fully trust him yet, man. We scratch his back, he scratches ours. As long as that's all he wants, I'm good. Agreed. Anyway, I'm gonna head back to the office. Cool. Later, man.
And stay down. <laughs>